All right, this video is, I'm not, I'm, this is the first video that I'm doing where I'm not actually doing any repair. This is just, uh, this is, it's not even a rant. <laughs> it's an anti-rant. This video is um, something I wanted to make for my friend, Louis Rossman, that I've intended to, to you know, make for, for a while, and it just sort of really struck me today. Um, and it's about, you know, kind of getting rid of negativity for a day. Uh, you know, negativity in this industry is really rampant. You know, we're always dealing with customers. They're, you know, having a bad day. Their phone is broken or their MacBook is broken. You know, they, they, they're bummed out, you know. Um, and it's easy for us as, you know, independent repair shop folks to, you know, kind of, you know, get, get annoyed with the, uh, you know, the having to be really professional hope dashers and, and, and our job is to, you know, let people know that nothing's ever easy. There is no quick fix for whatever their problem is. And it's, and, you know, it kind of gets negative after a while. All the forums are filled with people, you know, complaining about customers and about parts and things not working. And, um, and I, I watched, I watched Lewis's uh, video that he posted today uh, and it, it just drove me crazy. It was, uh, you know, he posted a video um, where he's uh, talking about a, a, someone who wrote in and said, you know, essentially, hey, I notice you're not posting any board repair videos in a week and you're not answering questions, you know, are, are you all about the money? Are you a sellout for the course? And man, what, <laughs> I can't imagine getting a, a message like that. You know, that really stinks. You know, it's just so, so negative. And, and, it, and it really made me sad because today is, is um, should be, I think, a, a celebration for Lewis because today I noticed that his YouTube channel hit uh, 10,000 subscribers. So that was a big milestone for him today. And I'm really, really proud of him for that. That's just absolutely amazing to be able to deliver, you know, content that, you know, 10,000, 10,000 people, it's like a college, you know, that 10,000 people um, find so compelling that they want to plug in and see that every single day. So that that's just absolutely amazing. And I thought of him, um, and I, I thought of him, uh, today because I got an email that was not negative from one of my um, subscribers. And so I'm, I got this email that I'd like to share that says, um, uh, this, is from, this is from a guy from the UK, and he says, I've been repairing iPhones as a hobby, uh, not doing any soldering, and recently bought an iPad mini with a broken screen. And of course, he ended up with the iPad mini backlight problem and he put it aside for ages and, uh, and then it says that he trolled the internet and it was not until I found your videos that I gained the confidence to tackle the job because not only did they instill confidence, they also explained everything in detail from how to solder, default finding, and what components should read and a bit about schematics. And he, he says, I now know more about practical repair from your videos than I've ever known and I'm now considering making it a full-time career. And then he talks about, you know, how he'd love to be able to come out to the course, and if not, he's just very appreciative of the, you know, the video, the tiny number of videos that I've put up. Um, and uh, and he says that he would, he would love to be able to watch some quality videos rather than some of the no nothing, no idea crap that's floating about on the internet. You have probably changed my direction in life, and I'd like to thank you for all the hard work that you've put into what you're doing, health, wealth, and happiness. And, and that's a really nice message, and, uh, and thank you for sending that in. Um, and, and it sort of made me think about how important it is to appreciate you know, people in your life that have made a difference. And so I wanted to take this, this tiny little video on this sort of special day for Lewis to appreciate him. Um, you know, he has been, for me, that person that has really, really inspired me and supported me and been just a fantastic friend. I'm so glad to, to know him. I've, I've only known him um, you know, for just about a year, maybe, maybe even less. And, uh, he has just, um, been so inspirational and I've changed a lot of what I've done and learned a lot as I kind of am a newcomer to, um, to, you know, running a, a business doing board level repair. And, uh, and I'm very grateful for, for everything that he's done for me, especially, you know, I never really got a chance on this channel to, to, you know, kind of let everyone know how he has 
just, you know, felt the brunt of all of my, you know, all of my negativity. So I vent on him and have for months. Um, so he's the one that gets to hear about when things aren't going well for me. And, you know, he hears about my problem customers and my problem repairs. And I can remember really struggling with, uh, with my, uh, you know, attempts, early attempts at BGA chip replacement, just the simplest chips, and I couldn't get it. And I, I would just complain, and I was just couldn't believe I just couldn't do it. It was so frustrating. And he listened, and he listened, and he listened, and then one day he said he was going to, you know, it's, he was going to pack up his very own personal hot air station and mail it to me uh, just to, just so that he felt that it was an equipment failure, and he was right. And, uh, and, and so when he was going to do that, I was like, all right, <laughs> you're right. I'm going to buy the right equipment. So I, I changed my station from the uh, non, I assume, not calibrated 802 that I was using um, to this, you know, 801 that I absolutely love. And it's been easy ever since then. So he, he was the one that sort of pushed me towards that. And then a few months down the road, you know, he's seeing me start my YouTube channel with the crappiest, shittiest, awful videos they're still there you know where I'm balancing a laptop trying to capture an image from a monitor and it's too dark and too light the audio is from the microphone on the um, on the MacBook and you know I'm trying so hard to edit it and I'm trying to like you know figure out how to do the camera capture and I uh, and I, um, I can remember this one time, you know, I'm reading forum posts, what equipment do I need to get? I I'm bought a black magic thing that just absolutely wasn't working. And I found this forum post where a guy is describing exactly the problem I'm trying to solve. How do I get like, you know, video camcorder input and microscope camcorder input and kind of combine that in a sort of Mac based platform? And I was like, oh, this, this is exactly the question I have. And, I, and there's lots of threads here. I'm sure it's going to be answered. And I read that it was posted by some kid named Lewis Rossman. <laughs> and I know, damn it, you know, this is, you know, the, I know where this leads, that the answer is it's really not possible. It's not, not easy. And so in the end, you know, same thing. I'm complaining, crying about this. You know, everything's just negative, negative, negative. And, you know, he, he did the most amazing thing. And this is fairly recent where he, um, I told him I was going to go, I was done with it. I was going to just trash this MacBook. I hate Macs. You know, this sucks. Uh, get me out of here. You know, um, I, I, I'm just starting over. And I asked him to tell me what computer I should buy at Best Buy, you know, to, to solve this problem. And he just wrote back, you know, do not be such a mom to go buy your computer at Best Buy. Who knew? So he, um, so he built me an amazing machine and it's right here and it's cool looking. It's like a big girl grown up computer. And what I love about this is that he knows that I hate LED lights. So he, after he had put it together once, he took it apart and he like punctured each little uh, LED diode just because it was this like, just so thoughtful, you know, just a, such a positive caring thing to do that I just was really really touched by that and then he you know he gave me his camcorder that he is his original camcorder that I'm using right now this microphone you know whatever this stuff is and he and he you know took the time to, which I now know it takes a long time to make videos he took the time to make a video that tells me exactly um, I think it was called how to plug in the microphone I mean it was I, you know, I, I'm sure it's not as insulting as it kind of sounds because I think it was really, you know, he just he just really wanted it to just work for me. And I and I really appreciate that. So so congratulations, Lewis, 10,000 subscribers. That's that's really amazing. I'm really proud of you. And I want for you to know um, this sort of positive message and uh, and for everybody to know, you know, what a great friend you are and and how how grateful I am to know you. And, and how much I'm looking forward to continue, continuing to, to work with you. It's been so much fun already, and I know that's just going to continue. So congratulations.